The Port Augusta power station is no more. But the coal-fired power plant left behind a potentially toxic legacy, a pollutant known as fly ash. Now it could have a greener future as a key ingredient in local cement. We're going to make green cement at Port Augusta using 100% renewable energy. That's going to make the greenest cement as compared to anywhere in the world. The Halleck Group's begun work on this distribution facility at Port Adelaide and plans to have its cement manufacturing plant at Port Augusta open by 2024. The company wants to reuse waste products from the Port Perry smelter and potentially the Wyala Steelworks. So there's now a 20 million tonne resource there which can take through, you know, that can supply South Australia's supplementary cementitious needs for decades to come. The Upper Spencer Gulf in particular has got so much potential up there and I think this is the, could be just the start of revitalising it. Traditional powdered cement manufacturing is a huge carbon emitter. For every tonne of green cement used, is roughly one tonne of CO2 saved. The company hopes to replace a huge chunk of the traditional cement imported from overseas. Chris McLaughlin, ABC News, Adelaide.